a room. channel today B and I are in Rome this is our first night or first day here we got here at around noon we took the train back to our hotel and we knocked out we took an overnight flight thinking that we would be well rested for the day but we were not so we're just gonna explore the streets for day one so there's not much content today but we're gonna try and find some pizza and pasta and food Ooh. Oh, hey there. Maybe gelato. <laughs> All the good stuff. Yeah. And then we have an early morning tomorrow, so hopefully we can go to sleep early tonight. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Ooh, what'd you get there? We got a vegetarian pizza. <laughs> so I think that's a margarita, no? Oh, it's a vegetarian here. Yeah, I was going to say margarita too, but I realized you're so... Um, Basil on it. All right, so tell the people how much was the damage, first of all. Actually, I don't know. I think it was 10 euros. Uh, no, nine euros, yeah. eight euros. All right, first bite impression. Mmm, mm hmm. The crust is really good. I like how light it is. Showing them texture. Flavor is good too, eh? Not too salty. Mm -hmm. Get a lot of tomato flavor. Mm -hmm. Maybe just, you know, because it's that first bite of food in Italy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we might be a little biased. Mm -hmm. But, anyways, any last words? No. Nope. Cheers. Now this is the other side of the Colosseum. Day two on our trip, and we're on our way to check out the Vatican. <laughs> we're going into check-in security. It's hot. It's hot. Oh, okay.
we're on a little break and I got a strawberry milkshake. We got this frozen coffee tiramisu type of drink. Sorbet. Sorbet. And we got some panzerotti type of thingies. Just want to try that out. Yeah. They're like little mini pizza pops. Hi, we are back at our hotel room after many hours. <laughs> After the tour, what did we do? We saw the Sistine Chapel, which we weren't allowed camera or photography in. Um, but if you saw my first clip, or actually congrats if you made it this far in my video. If you saw the last, or the beginning of the tour, the guy wouldn't let me film myself tapping my ticket, which is weird because you're allowed to film in there, just not the Sistine Chapel, but whatever. Anyways, y'all see the footage. That was only half of it, to be honest. I think halfway through, I got way too hot and Everything just looked repetitive, still very beautiful, but repetitive. So I ended up filming most of it, I ended up just walking around trying to not die from the heat and enjoy it all. Um, at the end, we went over to uh, St. Peter's Square where we literally just melted away. We weren't sweating actually, it was just super, super hot. So it wasn't humid, but we took a taxi back home, we showered, then we literally knocked out for hours which is an accident because we were supposed to take like a half hour nap for an hour nap and just wake up and I was gonna do some stuff too but anyways it's like 8 9 p.m. now and we're getting ready for dinner so I will definitely take you guys out for dinner with us to see what we're gonna eat and yeah anything I'm missing babe no okay all right I'll show you guys the hotel room sometime soon it's very lived in right now so we're going all black today. I got a, a hot little black dress and then Brandon's matching with his little black shirt and his khakis. Alright, I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, we're just about to go have a uh, sip of water here. Take a walk. These free water fountains located throughout the city. Ice cold and free. <laughs> 